J. Jones Cardio One, man, you already know what it is. Um, I had a little thing with the uh, FedEx yesterday. Not a little thing. I just had to. Um, I went and had to do some things. Um, I don't know about a quarter to eleven. I had an appointment that I had to be at. I couldn't miss it. Um, so FedEx um, said by the end of the day yesterday that they would be here with my package that you see here, um, and they weren't. Well, they actually were here. They were here at. Um, 11.30, 11.29 by the, by the note. I was actually looking for the note, and I can't seem to find it. I think I ended up folding it up and throwing it up here, um, being so frustrated with uh, with them. As you can see, FedEx down there in the bottom right-hand corner right there. Sorry for it being so dark in here. It is early in the morning right now. But uh, as you see, Slice was out, and he went to work. Um, you see all the remnants of the uh, you know little foam and things of that nature just laying here on the floor. And, uh, what do we get, though? Um, looks like some Sundown Audio E12s. Nah, you know I wouldn't go that route. Um, even though I have nothing against Scar Audio or, um, some E12s. Even if they are made in China. Um, I'd be in here beating the hell out of them. Or out in the car, wherever they would end up. But anyway, um, Slice went to work and he did get to some boxes. I think there's like three or four of these little boxes. I mean, I don't know what's going on with that. Um, but anyway, um, I think they lead to something like this. Now, we all know that um, this is the way the car audio world is going these days. And this won't be my last unboxing on this particular brand. Or maybe on this particular brand. I'm just saying as far as uh, lithium goes in general. Um... You know, and I think my ride will improve a lot more and not be sagging like I'm doing the wheelie down the street. The opposite of how the uh, guys used to do it back in the day. Remember, they used to jack the cars up and put the big tires on the back and had them itty bitties up front. I'm kind of looking like that, but, you know, sagging from the back. I'm sure you guys get what I'm getting at. Um, you know, back in the day, we used to rock these, and I still rock these. Nothing wrong with these. Um, I haven't had this battery hooked up in, Lord knows probably six seven eight months i don't know somewhere around up in there ain't even had the charge on it so i don't know what it's sitting at right now i just took the uh the terminals off and i was so excited look i didn't even put the daggone washers on the uh on the battery however they didn't send me my bus bars that i was supposed to be receiving with this i ain't gonna trip on them um i'm gonna just go ahead and throw some zero gauge or something like that on them i haven't seen anybody do that i guess i could try to give a, a whirl at making some bus bars or whatnot, but I don't think I'm going to go that route. Um, I'm going to try the zero gauge route. You know how we used to do it back in the day before bus bars with these type batteries. We used to just take that little piece of zero gauge and tap it onto the next battery and keep things moving. I think I'm going to try something like that first. And uh, if that doesn't work out, um, they do make the upgraded versions. They do have some more upgraded versions of uh, some bus bars for these. Um, I might end up with something like that if my wire doesn't work out, but that's the route I'm definitely going to try first. Um, nothing against the company or whatever that shorted me on those, you know. Um, it's just things that happen, you know. Everybody's not perfect. Mistakes are made. and We move on. Well, let's see what the voltage of this battery is real fast. This has been sitting so long. It's kind of hard to do with one hand, but I'm trying, guys. Looks like we're at 12.7, and that battery's been sitting for a while. I haven't checked the uh, temps or anything, or the temps. I haven't checked the volts or anything on these cells. I'm sure it's right at 13.3 where it's supposed to be sitting at. Um, but yeah, this is just uh, 45 amp hours, I do believe. It's nothing big. I think this, uh, from the website, supports uh, 7 to 11,000. So, you know, I don't have near that much power, but... I was thinking about a front battery delete, but I'm kind of nervous, and I'm kind of nervous about, I've got, a, I've got this exact battery up front, and I'm kind of nervous about running them together, because um, I know that it eventually makes it rest at 13.3 or whatever, that's fine, I mean, I sit at like 13.3, 13.4 anyway, with the, uh, with the batteries that I have out there right now, so I'm not really worried about it, but at the same time, I'd like to just be running off straight lithium. I don't know if this is enough power to do that or not. Um, I've seen guys run 80s and 100s all day and just use that one battery. Um, so I don't know. 
I don't know yet. I really don't know what I'm going to do when it comes to that right now. Just kind of at a standstill um, with that. But anyway, guys, I just wanted to stop by this morning and, uh, you know, bring you this video since I failed to get the unboxing right. I actually did have an unboxing video, but I was kind of drunk and stuff. And, uh, you know, I figured that I could do better. So that's why I'm bringing you this. So, um, yeah, let me guys know what you think about um, lithium and where cardio is going these days. And uh, if you have it, <clears throat> you know, drop something down in the comments and let me know something. Um, and what do you guys think about the, uh, using one odd or whatever for the, for the terminals, since I got shorted on my terminals, what do you guys think about that? Um, I'm sure I could get a cheap piece of aluminum and make some, I mean, it's not really a big deal. I just don't have anywhere to clamp it down at, you know what I mean? I don't want to be holding nothing like that or trying to step on it or something like that. I don't know. I may, just depends on what I feel at the time. But I'm kind of leaning towards using that wire first. So leave me some feedback and let me know something. Peace and love, guys. See you guys soon with another cardio unboxing. Peace and love. Deuces.